can walk barefoot. So I started, this issue is coming up. So let's try and get the scientific part of it. Most of the chemical reactions that we have in the body, the food, get it converted into energy. Is an oxidation process. Exactly. Yes, now, what is oxidation? Oxidation is loss of electrons. Yes, Antioxidants, huge plethora of electrons wait, waiting to be taken by you. Earth. Earthing, what do you do? You earth a system so that the electrons get, your body becomes positively charged. Or at least certain areas of the body. This is disease. So I said, actually, if the electrons are there in plenty of all over the earth, now why do we get it because of the lightning? And there is, every moment there is some lightning taking place on this earth, somewhere, maybe South America or Australia, but then it gets distributed like a conductor. That a part of it. Whichever way the electrons get, the electrons are repeat of the earth. So if I just come in contact with the earth, there, there was a company in the US which had manufactured certain blankets. Same logic. Because people who live in multi stories, they don't have any opportunity of getting down and standing barefoot on the ground. So they set a plug, you are connected to the earth. If you can sleep for six, seven hours a night, you are connected to the earth. Your body gets the electrons uh, which it had lost during the oxidation process. Such is the logic behind things. If only we can understand how to understand this process of what's happening inside us. And I don't think God created bio and maths, physics and chemistry. God created life. And you can understand it using everything together. Unfortunately, in the age that I do work, people would say, if you're good at math, don't study bio. If you're all the logic works. 